the Dex trades. Um, we can kind of, so every morning or whatever, I try to have a look first. Uh, I'd like order them by time. Uh, so I think this is updated, yeah. Uh, so this is in time order, kind of the top transactions on DEXs uh, by smart money wallets. So you kind of need to comb through uh, quite a bit. So initially, like I said, I start with time because you might see um, like really early moves and then you might be able to capitalize on that in terms of like, uh, like yesterday I saw quite a lot of people buying uh, SHIB, I think it was. And then I saw Alex's tweet actually that it was like up 40% or something. Uh, I, of course, didn't buy that uh, coin, so I missed out on that. Uh, but yeah, so that's where you kind of start with time, see if you can uh, catch things early. Uh, and obviously I do that as well because I'm like trying to look for like good tweets. <laughs> uh, so I need to get ones before everyone else does. Uh, so yeah, if you go through, I think one important uh, note to make as well is like, I almost wrote uh, something about Alameda because they were buying a lot of um, Lido token, as you can see here, actually. But the thing is with Alameda, and I know everyone wants to see like, what is Alameda buying? I want to copy trade them or whatever. Uh, but they are very like difficult to kind of one understand what they're doing, but also they might buy something and then I look like an hour later and they've sold it. Uh, so they're like really just trading all the time. So you can't read too much into what uh, Alameda buys because they're always on the list, um, always buying various different things. But yeah, they do have wallets which are like long holds, but the ones where it's like Elite Dex Trader. Uh, yeah, don't read into it as if they're going to buy it and hold it because you'll probably uh, get dumped on by Alameda. Yeah, so don't probably do that. Uh, yeah, so I keep going through, uh, see if anything stands out uh, in, terms of, in terms of time order. Uh, we were going to talk about this one, um, but I don't know if we'll get around to it, maybe later. So this one is quite interesting because uh, it's Sifu, who whatever got revealed a few months ago. Um, he has been doing a lot of transactions today. So this is one that kind of stands out as interesting. Um, obviously, he got like shunned or whatever, if that's the word. But he still has a lot of money and still labeled as smart money. Uh, so he's quite an interesting wallet, actually, to follow. Um, if we can see an example. I don't know if it was on Dex Trades or not. But he actually confusingly was, oh, here. So there's a token called Sifu. I don't know if this is alpha, definitely not. More just kind of funny. <laughs> uh, but he actually actively trades this, it looks like. Um, I couldn't even see if it has any value. But yeah, so here you can see $200 for five Sifu, <laughs> which is kind of funny. I don't know what he's doing there. But yeah, uh, as you can see, keep going through. I'm kind of looking for more people that might be interesting. Uh, Tetranode who also hopefully we might look at later. I was saying to uh, Darren and Daniel, uh, Tetranode has a very like interesting wallet because obviously he's gone off Twitter now, known as like notoriously rich. Um, but if you try and like take a look at his wallet, we might do later. He does a lot of like bridging, um, a lot of use of other chains for stable coins and stuff. So obviously he's a bit conscious, it looks like of people watching and trying to understand what he does um, because it's very, not difficult, but very complex to kind of understand what he's up to. Uh, so yeah, keep going through. This is what I would do basically, see if there's anything interesting. Apollo Capital, it's quite interesting. They've sold whatever this token is into your, I think I've seen that popping up actually, might be another unlock. So if you like look each day, you begin to see uh, patterns of uh, tokens that initially seem weird and then probably seem look like they've got some uh, pattern going on in terms of maybe like an unlock. So yeah, that's what I would do for time. I find this one really interesting um, and find a lot of kind of gems on here because what people can do as well um, is the initial thing is what I'm going to do now is like to increase the take amount and filter by that because then you're seeing the biggest transactions. Um, but often these smart money wallets, they transact in smaller batches. Um, so you might miss out on actually a lot of the alpha because if you go by 
the largest amount. It's interesting, of course, like here, uh, $50,000 by Tetra Node is interesting and to, something to explore, but you can kind of miss out on. So let's say he did $51,000 uh, trades instead of $150,000. Uh, you can miss it if you just filter by uh, the amount. Um, yes, this is a good example here of them like selling link uh, for wrapped ETH, um, which you might be like, oh no. <laughs> but then if you check back one hour later, they might be buying links. So Alameda, not much to kind of take from uh, in terms of the DEX trades. 